the ruins. Hey everyone, we are back in Skyrim. We are going to continue on with one of the Dark Brotherhood quests. Since we're pretty much completed with the Thieves Guild. I mean, I still have to do some jobs to get the them restored, but that I can do eventually if I feel like it. Right now, we need to continue on with some other quests. Get moving. I still have to speak to some more Daedra eventually so we can have 16 of their artifacts. I'm gonna take that shovel just so I can get that piece of gold. You guys look like you had a bad time. I'm not gonna lie. Alright, here's some scary spooky skeletons. Apparently he's over there somewhere, guys. You guys didn't have a good time either. You had an awful time. Like, they didn't even bury you in the right spot. They like dropped you down a well and left you here. How rude. No. By the almighty divines, you've come. Sir. You've actually come. This dreadful black sacrament thing. It worked. It sure did. The Nightmare heard your please. Yes, um, so it would seem. Well, I won't waste your time. I would like to arrange a contract. Several, no actually. I dare say. The work I'm offering has more significance than anything your organization has experienced in, well, centuries. As I said, I want you to kill several people. You'll find the targets as well as their manners of elimination quite varied. I'm sure someone of your disposition will probably even find it enjoyable. My disposition? But you should know that these killings are but a means to an end. For they pave the way to the most important target. The real reason I'm speaking with a cutthroat in the bowels of this detestable crypt. For I seek the assassination of... Dun, dun, dun. The Emperor. Leaders rise and fall. Business is business. You don't know how happy I am to hear you say that. So much has led to this day. So much planning and maneuvering. It's as if the very stars are finally but aligned. Today is not this but I digress. Day. Here, take these to your uh, superior. Rexus, the items. You didn't even clap. Now your hands, you know, should have touched. Here. Yeah. Here. The sealed letter will explain everything that needs to be done. The amulet is quite valuable. You can use it to pay for any and all expenses. Give me that. Give me a cheese. Okay, we'll go. Is there something else you need? Uh, that man's leg. That's what I need. I think this is the closest to 50 I've ever been in Skyrim. Uh, without touching much of the DLCs. I mean, I touched a little bit of... Uh, the Dawn Guard, but not too much of it. All right, I need to go this way, I think. Yes. Maybe that. It's kind of a weird light and ice shield. The colors, I think. Ooh, I think we get Shadow Mirror. It's either before or after this quest. We get a horse. One that I don't have to pay for. Or steal. All that fun stuff. I 
Hey, you. You're back. Good. All right, so, did you meet this Motier? What did he want? Mine's just to kill you, You're joking. Do I look like I'm joking? What's this? Let her explain By Sithis, you're not is joking. To kill the Emperor of Tamriel. The Dark Brotherhood hasn't done such a thing since the assassination of Pelagius. As a matter of fact, no one has dared assassinate an Emperor of Tamriel since the murder of Uriel Septim, and that was 200 years ago. Aka okay, Morrowind. No, Oblivion. I'm no, getting it all she certainly wouldn't. confused. And for whatever reason, she chose to relay Motier's information to you. I don't know exactly what's going on here, if you're the listener, or this is some fluke, or what, but what we now have before us. So we'll accept it. <laughs> you're damn right we'll accept it. If we pull this off, the Dark Brotherhood will know a fear and respect we haven't seen in centuries. You think I'd abandon an opportunity to lead my family to glory? But this is all so much to take in. I need time to read the letter and figure out where we go from here. Of course she does. Amulet. Hmm. What were you thinking? I'm thinking we need that amulet appraised. I want to know where it came from, how much it's worth, and if we can actually get away with selling it. I could and technically go to the police. There's only one but... man who can give us what we need. Delvin Mallory. He's a fence, a private operator. Works out of the Ratway in Riften. I know give who me the Delvin letter. is. Bring Mallory the amulet. Find out everything you can and sell it if he's willing. He'll offer a letter of credit. That's fine. Delvin Mallory and the Dark Brotherhood have uh, history. He can be trusted. Well, I sure hope so, you know. I kind of worked with him. You, on the other hand, Astrid, cannot be trusted. Let's get indoors. With anything. At all. Period. Come on. I was gonna say, give me the Thieves Guild button. I wanna press the Thieves Guild button. Roar, I'm a vampire lord, look at me go. You see vampire lords, but you don't see many vampire ladies. To the ragged flagon. Onward. Hello, everybody. I've come to see an old friend. Something you need? Sir. Anything for the guild? I'm here on Dark Relight, bitch. Oh. oh, I see. Well, you're making friends all over, aren't ya? So, uh, how's Astrid doing these days? Tell her to stop by sometime. We can have a drink. Catch up. Ah, but business, of course. What kind of business? The devious kind, of course. What can you tell me Let's about this? Let's see. Where, oh, where did you get this? No, don't answer. I don't want to know. This is an amulet of the Emperor's Elder Council. Specially crafted for each member. Who have a small fortune. Ain't something you'd give up lightly. Look, it ain't my business to tell the Dark Brotherhood it's business. But if you killed a member of the Elder Council, you better believe me. Will you buy it? Buy it? This, an Elder Council amulet? Oh yes, oh yes indeed. Oh, wait, just one moment. 
Here is a letter of credit, usable by Astrid only, for any service or item I can provide, as per our standard arrangement. You bring that back to your lovely mistress, with my regards. The Lannister sends his regards. That I will tell her. Oh, can I stab her in the back too while I'm at it? Come on. No. I'm no fan of the sun, but it would be better than this. I'm glad that they got rid of that body, though. Looks more like a snake. Than the dragon it's supposed to be. Back to Astrid. just weird to look at. I don't really like looking at her much. Skill. I'm not overly fond of Astrid, but you guys will see later in the quest line why I don't like her. And why I wouldn't trust her. Good, you're back. Well, what did Mallory have to say? Is the amulet authentic? Yes, it is. The Elder Council? Oh, now that explains quite a bit. Motier, you naughty, naughty boy. Hiring the Dark Brotherhood to help you rise beyond your station. Delicious. Was Mallory willing to buy the amulet? He was. Here's your letter Splendid. of credit. Then we're ready to begin. Or, more specifically, you're ready to begin. After all, you're the one the Night Mother spoke to. Now then, I hope you have something nice to wear, because you're going to a wedding. A wedding? Well, more like the public reception. It should be a lovely affair. You'll mingle with the guests, eat some cake, stab the bride. Oh yes, you've got to kill the bride at her wedding. The Lannisters. And they say romance is dead. Just tell me to Very kill. well. The target's name is Vittoria Vici. She oversees the East Empire Company's business holdings in solitude. The wedding is being held in that city, at the Temple of the Divines. Her death will cause an uproar, which is exactly what we want. Remember, we want it's people trap. to notice. Kill Vici while she's addressing her guests, as is the custom, and I can promise a bonus. Now go, and give the bride a special kiss from me. Bound until death. Let's get indoors. Huh? I can hear a dragon way off into the distance. I don't want to fight you, dragon. I am very happy being very much alive. I need a shield. Is there a... Divines bless you. 
May the ground you walk quake as you pass. Yes, yes. What do you need? Wanderer like you must have plenty of tales to tell. But I'm Uh, you sixteen, eighteen, eighteen. Go fiddling with any locks around here. We're going to have a real problem. Dum dum diddy diddy dum 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 diddy diddy dum dum dum. Dum dum diddly dee dee dum 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 dum. Am I seeing? I'm so glad Victoria and Asgir chose a public reception. That way, the entire city can share in their holy bond. Are you going to address? This wedding is boring. I wish they had jugglers. My nephew, the Emperor, too busy to attend the wedding of his beloved cousin. We will be someone there. Where do they go? Figured you could use a hand when the chaos erupted. You have committed crimes against Skyrim and her people. What say you in your defense? Uh, Smart woman. Me. Now, come. Oh, get all of my goods. All of them. I shouldn't have stole off her. Yeah, shoots this way. Screw Astrid's word. Being law. I do what At I want. Last. <gasps> you killed Nurse, no shot. How dare you? This must be that beautiful Skyrim weather I've always heard about. She wasn't the one we were after. Why didn't you kill a guard? <laughs> the news is everywhere. Vittoria Vici, the Emperor's cousin, butchered at her own wedding. Well done. Let's see his eminence try to ignore this. Yes, the blushing, blushing bride is now serving. With Vici's <laughs> murder, you've started us down a path the Dark Brotherhood hasn't traveled in centuries. The assassination of an Emperor. And now your reward. A unique spell to summon a legend of the Dark Brotherhood. His soul serves us now in death, as his body once did in life. Unfortunately, in your zeal, you failed to eliminate Vici while she addressed her guests as directed. I'm sorry, but your bonus is forfeit. Well, she wasn't saying Gavin. anything. That's not my Time fault. Time to proceed to the next stage of the plan. Go and speak with Gabriella. She's been helping me arrange your next contract. Well, yes, we'll talk to Gabriella first before we do anything else. It's my word wall, which I've already gotten so, to. Is it true? Oh, you mean in that uh, manor house during the thunderstorm? <laughs> Dear sister, I've been waiting for you. With what the, the details? arrival in Skyrim now a certainty, his security service, the Penitus Oculatus, will need to begin its preparations immediately. Security is being handled by a Commander Morrow. Astrid and I have devised a plan to break the man, and in doing so, cripple the Emperor's protection. You are to slay the Commander's son, Gaius Morrow, 
And once he is dead, plant false evidence on his body, implicating him in a plot to kill the Emperor. I understand. He is set to leave the Penitus Oculatus outpost at Dragonbridge and inspect the security of each city in Skyrim. Go me, there uh, now. The Observe Gaius Moro's departure and follow him. Ah, Waylay him in one of the cities around. and yes. send his soul to Sithis. Really, Once he's dead, twine, plant the incriminating letter on his body hatchet. and let fate Once take care of the rest. Aye, aye, Captain. Oh, and one final thing. Yes. To earn your bonus, do not kill Gaius Morrow in Dragonbridge or on the road. Kill him in one of the other major cities he'll be visiting. There, the body will be discovered quickly, as will the letter implicating Gaius Morrow in the plot to assassinate the Emperor. Do that, and Astrid has authorized me to grant you a rather unique bonus. It is a special token to be given to Olava the Feeble in Whiterun. Olava is an old and dear friend, and a powerful seer. The token entitles you to a reading of your future. It's an opportunity one should not pass up. Walk in right. Gaius Morrow's shadow and deliver to him the judgment of Sithis. Ah, you're back. It was good to fight alongside you. I'm sure people won't be forgetting that wedding anytime soon, hmm? Oh. Right, I, I was wondering why there was a an Argonian talking to me there. It was him, I forgot. <laughs> Let's get indoors. Or in You guys move. Shadow mirror. Someday we will meet. But I shall leave this here. We complete it bound until death. We'll continue on, I think, with the Brotherhood in the next episode. Just to try to finish up these guys. And then hopefully soon move on to Daringard. Maybe finish the main quest. I'm not sure. We can probably soon start the Dragonborn, I guess. I will see you then.